how to deal with stress and studying more. Really changed, like, especially my essay writing. I couldn't really write an essay before this, but it's really, like, taught me how to, like, better connect things to my life. Okay, well, I guess it's taught me that, you know, you can achieve things that you didn't think you could. Been more aware of what things can symbolize and... like a light turning on and off. Last year was kind of crazy and I felt like I was very shy and innocent and I didn't know like if I could answer a question or not and then this year I got out of that shell and decided to share my opinion with others and that's really helped me blossom. I think that before I started doing this class I um, I really didn't try to look deeper into things and I didn't really uh, notice different things around me and since then I've learned like whoa there's in a simple phrase of text there can be so much more meaning inside of it. I have become a much better person and teacher because of this class. Um, part of it is working with Mr. Duffin because we have very different like natural teaching styles and like personality styles just in life. I, I think the other thing is that I have um, solidified my belief that teenagers are way cooler than most people think they are. You guys are crazy smart and crazy capable and care about things and I, I think fight for you even harder than I thought I would. I like that they're more lenient and they're easy to talk to. Like, if you get behind on something, you can talk. Or like, like if you miss a day or something, you can just go and talk to them. Um, I really like um, kind of their step back nature a little bit. I really love that they keep everything really open. It seems like every teaching subject we have, Mr. Duffin has some sort of crazy funny story that goes along that you learn something from with that subject. And Miss Newman always has something that like, she always has some way to relate everything to everything else. I, I think it's really funny how they play off each other, but at the same time kind of go to war with each other. Um, I really like being able to discuss um, questions with people. Um, it's really like helped me realize that there are people with lots of different like personalities and like learning how to cope with those people. Good. I really love the unity between everyone. Um, I like that I've learned how to read other culture literature and try to embrace it and like make it a part of my life. It's kind of awesome. Yeah. Just the way that they teach it, they don't give a mundane assignments. You get to write a lot, which is cool. And with like spell work and free writing, I think that's fun. I think it's brilliant and inspired. It's very special. It's well written. I think it's awesome. And you guys should make a music video out of it and then post it on YouTube so it can go viral. And that would be awesome and I think it should be entered into many contests and played in Mr. Duffin's car on like a continual loop until his brain explodes. You get little red hairs all over the car. <laughs> well, I have to admit, I was a little bit nervous, but then I had to like, you know, just let go of my ego and just enjoy it for the beautiful piece of art and satire that it is. And once I could let go of my own ego and just enjoy it, I laughed on the inside, not on the outside, but on the inside, I enjoyed it. Miss Newman. I'd say probably Miss Newman. Miss Newman would. <laughs> I think it would be a tie because Miss Newman has like fire in her and Duffin's just like, hey, I, I, I'll fight you if you want. Newman and Duffin would have an excellent battle in which Duffin would die first, but then Miss Newman would later die from 
her many boobs. I think, well, my gut instincts tell me that Newman would win. However, I think that there's a sword in the back office, and I think that Duffin would grab it. My original, my first instincts say Miss Newman because she's more like aggressive on the outside, like more openly aggressive, but then Duffin's like the one who would plot and plan about it, so he really could win based off of his like secret strategies. Newman would win in a fight because, not because Duffin isn't good, but Newman's just better. Hands down, Dr. Gregory Lawrence Duffin the first. And I'll tell you why, because he has a little thing called Duffin Song to back him up. And that song right there, that's how you win. You come in with that music, and, and you win. And he's got that, and it, it, it's amazing. Really. I'd say Miss Newman. Honestly, she would probably lay back and convince the class to fight Mr. Duffin for her behalf, so obviously Miss Newman will win. Obviously, I would win in the fight, except for by winning, I would not win. So I'd have to find a way to win, but let her believe that she won. Me. I have a really, I have a really impressive glare, and Mr. Duffin would be too afraid to fight me. 